Simple integrals and derivatives explained in 60 seconds. So let's say you have some function on the xy plane. The integral is the area under that curve, represented by this symbol. The integral is the opposite of the derivative, which finds the slope of the function at all points. For example, if you're finding the derivative of a line, it's going to be the slope of the line at all points, so it's just going to be a horizontal line. Since the line is constant. If you find the integral of the line, you're finding the area under the curve. Since the slope is negative, meaning the line is decreasing, it's going to result in a concave down parabolic function. Now, let's do an example. When taking the integral or derivative of simple polynomial functions such as this, you want to use this rule. You're going to want to multiply x by the exponent and then take away one from the exponent. So taking the integral is just the inverse process of taking the derivative, but you also have to add a plus c. Meaning you add one to the exponent, then divide it by n plus one. The plus c just represents any constant, because if you take the derivative of a constant, you get zero. So taking the derivative, this goes away, this x goes away, the two is multiplied in front, and then one is taken away from the exponent, so you get four x plus four, and then the integral is the reverse process. You add one to each exponent, add a c, and then divide each by the new exponent. So this becomes, boom. So in general, the derivative is all the slopes, and the integral is the area under the function. That's it, you are now past the 60 second mark. I can't say anything else. If you want me to make a longer video, I can still do that. Just like and subscribe and comment for that to happen, because I'm not gonna do it without that.